So my name is Mary Struger. I'm trained in nutrition, functional medicine, but also psychotherapy, human given psychotherapy. Um, I've been working with patients, clients, for 22 years, um, based now partly at the Hospital of St John and St Elizabeth in St John's Wood, um, but also in a private clinic in West London, and then also at a practice in Surrey. And uh, I've worked with Tony Gavain and PTSD resolution for about five years now, and so have quite a body of veterans that I've worked with. Now, some of them come to me with depression and upset. Um, I gave an example in the talk uh, about uh, somebody called Zach who was in a secure mental health unit. He was on very heavy medication. Um, he's ex-special forces. He was quite a remarkable person. In fact, the reason partly he'd been sectioned was that he'd had three uh, almost successful uh, suicide attempts. And, you know, he was very, actually quite seriously injured when, because he'd, instead of hurting another person, and I think this is just the type of training of special forces, he was so angry that he'd actually put his own arm through a plate glass window and it was very cut up. Now, getting to know him, he was actually one of the most courageous, ethical, nice men. And, you know, that goes across pretty much all the people that I see. And, um, you know, I, I think as a therapist, obviously I'm working with the general public, but there is something a little bit different when you're working with veterans. And you do go the extra nine yards or, you know, because you really want to help them. And uh, I would say the results that we've had um, using, you know, because I do use the de-trauma techniques within, obviously, uh, the human givens, uh, you know, training. But I have this added extra element, which because of the nutrition functional medicine side, the research is so advanced now, particularly um, from places in America like the Institute for Functional Medicine, is we know every single neurotransmitter. We know what upregulates them, downregulates them. We know what drugs work in what ways. And actually, nutritionally, this is advanced. This is not something that um, somebody not trained could do. Um, but at the same time, there is an advanced level of knowledge. I was encouraging people within the conference because there were a lot of human given, psych human given psychotherapists present, is to say, look, just try to get them on a really good diet. And I explained a really good diet is one that's purported by the head of Harvard Medical School, well, epidemiology in Harvard Medical School, which is Professor Walter Willett. And he came up with a very good food pyramid that's a good handout and will be made available, I think, perhaps on the website. Um, and I've also made available other handouts. But there's a slightly more uh, advanced one, which gives all the information about, you know, what helps different neurotransmitters. So again, I don't want you to get lost in this, um, but I think there are different levels people can engage with this information.